Starting gate to the top of the stretch, now picking up speed, and here they come. And they're off and trotting. Shooting out from the center goes Distance Learning. A few others are driving forward, including Durf Hanover. And Gigondis on the outside is muscling ahead. Mr. Mayor Hanover is getting away in fourth. That one's outside. Nacy will be on the outside moving into the turn. Southwind Coors then going to Bettina Hanover, who is followed by all wrapped up in the early trailer, is Walk on the Moon. Around the first turn, Gigondis at 10 to 1 shows the way. The opening panel was 27 seconds flat. So a sharp opening quarter here as the trotters come out of the first turn. Durf Hanover in second. Distance Learning is in third. Mr. Mayor Hanover fourth. Settling in, Nacy found a spot in fifth in front of Southwind Coors, who is tracked by Bettina Hanover. All wrapped up is second from last, and Walk on the Moon remains at the back and will shoot up the rail as we'll wait for that outer flow to develop. And it does from mid-pack with Nacy first up. Gigondis with the lead. Durf Hanover second. Distance Learning gets chased out a third here. That provides some cover for Nacy, as in at the rail is Mr. Mayor Hanover. Third over is Southwind Coors, being followed by Bettina Hanover at the rail. Walk on the moon. The new trailer is all wrapped up. 57 and 2 was the half as Gigondis caught a breather in the second quarter. And Gigondis ramps it up with distance learning, applying pressure on the outside. Gigondis by half a length. Distance learning is second. Inside third, Durf Hanover. Nacy is perfectly spotted. Southwind Coors sits third over, just three lengths from the lead. At the rails, Mr. May Hanover in sixth. 125 and 3, 28 and 1 in the third quarter. Into the stretch. G. Gondis is trying to hang in there, but distance learning now overtakes. Off cover, here comes Nacy, and on the outside is Southwind Coors. Up the rail is coming Durf Hanover. A good finish here. Nacy in the center, takes the lead. Southwind Coors on the outside, hanging in there, distance learning at the rail. Durf Hanover all wrapped up from the back. Southwind Coors on the outside, trying to get by Nacy. Nacy and Southwind Coors. Southwind Coors wins the season debut. Nacy finished in second. It appeared to be all wrapped up third, 154 and 3. takes. Off cover, here comes Nacy, and on the outside is Southwind Coors. Up the rail is coming Durf Hanover. A good finish here. Nacy in the center, takes the lead. Southwind Coors on the outside, hanging in there, distance learning at the rail. Durf Hanover all wrapped up from the back. Southwind Coors on the outside, trying to get by Nacy. Nacy and Southwind Coors. Southwind Coors wins the season debut. Nacy finished in second. It appeared to be all wrapped up third, 154-3. Third race reaching up in 154 and 3. Southwind Coors is a four year old gelded son of Walner, owned by Backstable, Glengate Farms, Dave Hudson, and Craig Wilson. Winning trainer is Matt Bax. The winning driver is Todd Ratchford. Last season, Southwind Coors won four of 13 starts, made over $233,000, competed in many of the big dances on the grand $2 exacta paid $95.70, the $2 daily double $119.20.